In the last episode, I have shown the unboxing and a full review of my all new MacBook Pro with M1 chip where I already mentioned that there is no option to access your USB Type-A devices nor any SD card due to the missing ports in this laptop. The laptop carries only a single microphone port and two USB Type-C ports. And if you have missed that video, then please go and watch it. I will also share the link in the description box. Now to access my old USB-A devices, I first tried with this USB Type-C to USB-A adapter which can access only a single USB-A device at a time. But what if you want to use multiple USB-A devices and SD card in your laptop simultaneously? For this you will need to have the device which I will be showing in this video. Hello YouTube, welcome to Gizmo Hub for technical support. But before that, hit the subscribe button and also the bell notification to get more such videos like this. Here is the 7 in 2 USB-C Thunderbolt 3.0 hub that supports 13 inch and 15 inch MacBook Pros from 2016 till 2019. It also supports the new MacBook Air 2018-19 as well as the new M1 chipped MacBooks. This product is from Tekta and is available in almost all online stores. And inside the box you will get this user manual with all the product information in it and the product itself. It's a 7-in-1 USB-C device that includes two Thunderbolt 3 USB Type-C then two USB 3 type A ports, one SD card reader port, then one micro SD card reader and also one HDMI port. Uh, you will get all the three color options available based on your MacBooks that is the silver, the grey as well as the gold one. The product is very lightweight and, th and the body feels premium. Now I will show you by connecting my devices with this product in my laptop. Just to test, I will be using few multiple devices like uh, first of all I will be using the Type-C for charging purpose then I will use the USB Type-A and one SD card and again one uh, USB Type-C device and as you can see uh, all the devices, I mean all the disks are now detected in my system so this is working perfectly fine there's also a hdmi port on the top of it which i have al already tested using my uh, by connecting to my tv so it's also working fine and that's all friends hope you enjoyed this video see you all in my next episode